Would you like to learn about three brand new tiny millionaire maker crypto coins under $1 that haven't even hit the market yet and are launching very soon? Do you want to win more trades? Do you want to earn extra income with crypto? And do you want to see your portfolio massively in the green for the next bull market? Our 12 days of Christmas sale is here and the price of enrollment for our online program will increase every day until December 25th. We will then be closing our doors for enrollment for for the rest of the year so now is the time to take massive action you'll also receive exclusive bonuses that will only be available until the end of this sale by enrolling today you will get lifetime access be able to watch at any time from anywhere all while learning at your own pace and joining our community of more than 3,500 members from all around the world many of my students in the last bull run earned thousands of dollars using my exact system which helped me turn ten thousand dollars into two hundred and fifty thousand dollars and become a cryptocurrency millionaire so don't delay the the clock is ticking and prices will begin increasing on December 14th. Simply click the link down below in the description or visit JoeParis.com. Welcome to the YouTube channel. My name is Joe. So make sure to smash up the like button, click the subscribe button, and hit the notification bell to be notified every single day when I come out with a new video. They are very time sensitive and you're not going to want to miss out. Also, please know that everything that I say is not financial advice and these videos are for educational and inspirational purposes only. In full disclosure, we do own some of the cryptocurrencies that I will be speaking about in today's video. And if this video gets 5,000 likes within the first 24 hours, we will do a very special giveaway for our YouTube community. So let's smash up that like button and let's get started. All right, so in the rest of this video, we're going to be breaking down three coins. They haven't even hit the market yet. You you're getting a chance to get an inside look. And at the time of this recording, we don't even have all the information that we need to know about these coins. But I want to share with you what's most important about crypto. You see, if a cryptocurrency is going to pump up a lot or even drop down a lot, the most ideal situation is to always be an early investor. That way, your risk is the lowest. So when you get into these coins is everything. Because if you're able to get in the earliest, that means you're lower the risk and may also have the highest upside potential. So you're learning about three coins right now that most people aren't even talking about. They're not even paying attention to. And the first coin is actually... The second part of a crypto that I've talked about and made a dedicated review about, it's only about 46 days old at the time of this recording. That is Titan X, but really, it's all about a new coin called Hyper. Now, what is Hyper? Well, I made a whole video outlining what the founder has kind of said about Hyper, but I want to share with you even more about what we know about this crypto today. So right now, according to the Titan X white paper, Hyper will be the first protocol to be built on top of Titan X. And right now, all the information is confidential, but I want to give you a little inside hint, a little clue about where we could maybe see some more information and when, because everyone wants to know, well, when is Hyper and what's going to actually happen with this? So, Jake Sharp, the founder of Titan X, tweeted on X or posted on Twitter here, just 28. So you can see he did this on December 7th, which is about over a week ago right now, and just said simply 28. Now, if you know anything about Jake and you also know anything about Titan X, the number eight has a lot of importance for this entire ecosystem. Let me share with you some examples. So if you click on payouts here, this is where you can see there's an eight day payout, a 28 day payout, a 90 day payout, 368, and then there's an 888 day payout. So the number eight is very important to this entire ecosystem. And funny enough, the 28th of October is when Titan X actually launched. So a lot of people are speculating, with him tweeting this out, kind of towards the holiday season here in December, that on the 28th of December, maybe, we could see some news around Hyper. And Jake has also said in multiple streams that it's not going to be months down the road before Hyper or, you know, years. He said it could be weeks to potentially months before we see an update. And that would make a lot of sense from what we've seen here with what he's what he said and then what he's also tweeted out. Now, if you don't know what the brass tacks, basically what, what Hyper is, being the first protocol built on top of Titan X, it's basically a way for you to burn your staked Titan X or your liquid Titan X. And in exchange, you will receive this new token called Hyper. Now, the only thing that you'll be able to do with Hyper, I believe, in the very beginning is stake your Hyper for more hyper. It kind of works very similarly to how hex works where you stake your hex and you earn more hex. Now the longer you stake, the more hex you earn in APR. Uh the you know the, the bigger you stake, right? So the more of it you stake, the more you earn as well. And 
I guess for now, we're going to be left in the dark of what exactly all the details and nuances are until potentially a couple of weeks from now. Why am I excited about this though? I'm excited about this because it adds a whole new layer on top of a already successful crypto project in Titan X. So here's the current chart of Titan X sitting at five zeros and a seven. And I drew some lines for technicals of support and resistance. Now, this is a key level here for support. And there's multiple reasons why this is a key level. Now, it is anything in crypto, this can go up, right? Or it could also swing low and then we go lower. Okay, so there's always in cryptocurrency these two different scenarios. And where you can actually make money in both actually situations is if you understand the game theory and what you could potentially do with your Titan X. Now, I'm actually mining this cryptocurrency. I was in probably the second day here for this crypto. And I also was somebody who was mining a lot just a couple of weeks ago. So I have my position in this. But if this goes lower, I am going to be intrigued to see what the market does. And the reason why I'm intrigued for that is because there's some game theory that I've been sharing in my VIP group about why I personally will be buying at these lower prices if we get them. Now, this right here was that low range where I wish I would have just been paying attention a little bit more and would have grabbed up more buying in this area. If I would have known what I know today, I would have been a huge buyer in this area, not just because obviously the price went up, but because of the game theory and a couple of things that I understand right now. But what we can also see according to Dune Analytics, and this is a chart that has been created by Mike Dean, actually it's a lot of different charts, is if you scroll down here, you can see the total number of miners since the kind of initial launch after a couple of weeks here, we have seen quite a huge increase in miners. Now, you also see the total number of ETH. So obviously during the launch, a lot of people, you know, wanted to get in these first couple of days, a lot of hype and FOMO in there. But then also you can see the tight next minted supply. So you can see here that there's going to be a huge amount that's going to be coming out somewhere between November and November, I'm sorry, November 19th and November 26th, as well as now into December. So you can see here that the number of uh, minting is, is, is increasing as time is going on, but there are some days that it's not as much as it is for the other day. So here in December, right, you can kind of see here that there's not as much inflation, not as much inflation, and then there's a lot of inflation kind of right around the Christmas holiday time. Now, it's also important to see the future supply uh, for 14 days by the contract day. So you can see, um, basically, it looks very similar to what we're seeing there. And then also the Titan future supply in the next 30 days. So January 1st is obviously a big spike. People like to do the New Year's, like to mint things around that time. And it's just a milestone for a lot of people. So here's the 90 day supply. And then you also have the future supply, which this is a huge spike of, I think, a trillion tokens somewhere around here. I can't hover over this. But there's about a trillion tokens coming out right around that 280 day mark, which was from the launch of the crypto coin. So what does that tell us? It tells us that there could be opportunity looking in this middle gray zone here, but people might start minting out there because there may be opportunity there. But it also shows me that there's going to be more inflation which is going to be interesting to see then how that inflation is going to play in the chart of this crypto. And then also this is going to play into our new coin, Hyper, because you're going to basically be burning your tight necks to get the Hyper coin. So the more people that burn and they get into Hyper, it's going to take more money off the table. Now, if you keep looking too at even more of the buy and burn, as well as the uh, complete stats here, you will see but there's only 7% liquid supply right now. That's absolutely crazy. The majority has actually been bought and burned off of the market, and you can see the rest of it is staked. So there's not a whole lot of people just holding this liquid in their wallet. And well, there's multiple reasons for why they would be doing that or not doing that. The kicker though is this buy and burned as well as the user burned. So you can see here that there was a little testing of a user burn about $100 worth of this. And it'll be interesting to see how many people actually burn their Titan X for Hyper because one of the things that you can get from mining is if you were to mine today, you get the early adoption amplifier still, which is at an 8% rate, but there's also this burn bonus amplifier. Now, if you hover over this, you can see when you burn Titan X to get the principle of other protocols recorded in the smart contract based upon the number of total Titan X tokens that you burn, 
you get an amplifier on the amount of Titan X that you get per miner, up to 8%. The 8% max is hit when you've burned 80 billion Titan X tokens. Now, 80 billion Titan X tokens at the time of this recording is a significant sum of money. So why would people burn, though? Well, they would burn for hyper. Then, if they want to start more miners, they get this burn bonus amplifier, which is significant because this right here, this early adoption amplifier, in the first year, it will go away. So the people who got in early and they also mine for longer periods of time are going to be huge beneficiaries of this early adoption amplifier. But this whole protocol and this new crypto, Hyper, is designed to go from hyperinflationary, meaning there's tons of coins coming out, as I just showed you with Dune Analytics, tons of coins coming out, to all of a sudden in a couple of years, you can't mine all of this crypto anymore. It's the adoption amplifier is gone. And then also you have, it just gets harder and harder to mine and it gets more and more expensive. So to me, uh, if I'm looking at all of these metrics here, it might take some time for this all to play out, but this might happen a lot faster than we all believe as well. And the fact that a majority of the crypto is not even on the market, it's either burned itself and or staked, that shows me some really interesting things. And I wanna show you, uh, staking here all-time stakes you can see a majority of the stakes are staked for 3,500 days so that to me shows people are committed to this and also they're staking for a very long time and there's a reason to do that and that's for a whole nother video and for a whole nother time but I'm keeping my eyes on this project I'm keeping my eyes on hyper because I think we can have some news regarding this new crypto coin very very soon now, your number two crypto coin is one that we've talked about. They've redone their website, and that is D.Fi. Now, D.Fi 2.0. If you enter in your email here, this is where you're going to get special notifications about the token listing. Now, the token listing, according to their X and their Twitter, listing is coming very, very soon. So you can see here, um, it's going to be happening according to their uh, announcement. DeFi listing announcement. We have had an overwhelming public sale and is now officially closed. The next step is going to be listing. Now, it says here that it is January 27th, but it says listing is coming before January 27th. So I know it's hard to see there, but that's what it says. And it said over 3 million new unique users have joined the D.Fi platform in the last few months, and we have monumental plans for the DeFi listing. We are in an active discussion with the most prominent exchanges and market makers, many of which are our investors to ensure a grand and successful listing campaign that will take place before January 27th. Over the course of 2023, we have broken multiple Web3 records and innovated across multiple uh, groundbreaking tools. So this is the massive update that I want to share with you because this is going to come before you know it. January 27th will be here very, very soon. And to me, uh, if you were one of the lucky ones to be paying attention when I was sharing about this project, the public sale price reached a maximum of 39 cents. So it went from 27 cents to 39 cents. And my price prediction is that it's under a dollar today. I don't know how much longer it will stay under a dollar. Now, it could take a long time for this all to play out, but you know I wanted to share these updates because these came just a few days after the sale closed. Now, while they're attracting support from institutional investors and partners, they can assure you that DeFi listing will be an event that you don't want to miss. And we're working proactively to ensure that it will happen much earlier than January 27th. So again, you need to keep coming back and paying attention because they set a rough estimate guideline for this, but it could happen tomorrow, right? It's probably not going to happen tomorrow, but you get my point, right? It's it's kind of tentative that probably somewhere in the new year, they're going to be launching this thing. So stay tuned. We're going to be giving updates and the listings weekly. If you have any questions about the allocation, feel free to reach out to their customer service. Uh, D.Fi is coming soon. Be very careful going through customer service. There's a ton of scammers and people pretending to be a lot of these projects. Make sure to only use the official links that will take you to this project. And remember, do not give your passwords away. Do not send any cryptocurrency. Don't do any of that. Those are people who are trying to take your money. D.Fi will just answer questions, okay? So please don't do that. It's the most frustrating thing in the world because many of you are so new to this crypto game that you make these massive, massive mistakes. It seems obvious, but when I was new to crypto as well, I've made massive mistakes in you know doing things in cryptocurrency. 
giving money away for no reason at all, sending things to the wrong address, not understanding these little details. I'm telling you now, don't, don't, don't do that. And also take care of your own cryptocurrency. Make sure you know what you're investing in. Do your research and never risk more than you can afford to lose. Those are the updates for D.Fi, and that is your second cryptocurrency coin. Now, your third coin is Zyabot. Now, we have had some big news that just happened literally about this project, and it says, according to their X account, that BSC Pad and AI Pad IDO will be introducing Zyabot, which will be happening. The IDO date is Thursday, December 28th, 2023. Now, the initial token generation event market cap will be less than $100,000. Now, the launch date has not been set yet for this crypto at the time of this recording. The launch date has been set tentatively for some time in the new year in January. So again, make sure to follow only the official links for this cryptocurrency project to understand the risks and rewards with this as well. Again, this is a brand new project. We have no idea what will happen. We have seen lots of volatility in these projects. And with this recent announcement, AI pad is up an extra 15% at the time of this recording today. And that's because there's even a bonus for you here. And that is BSC pad has announced another IDO called Vapor Wallet. Now, Vapor Wallet is backed by Visa and this is launching on BSC pad AI iPad as well as NFT launch. Now the IDO date will be December 18th and will be listing on December 20th. The initial market cap will be 401k excluding liquidity. The vesting schedule will be 100% unlocked at the token generation event. So if you're new to all of what I just said, you're like, I don't know about these projects. I don't know how all these incubators and things work. I don't know how all of this actually happens. Click the links down below. Join me in VIP. I've been teaching this to many of my students for the last three years because no one is teaching this and they're not teaching you the risks, the rewards, and what has happened potentially in the beginning and the end of these projects. And a lot of these projects have a lot of hype and speculation in the beginning. Then a lot of the tokens get sold off. And again, the reason for this is because a lot of people are in massive profits. This was all during a bear market in the last year. And then potentially now we are starting to see more projects being built up on this project AI pad. So also see BSC pad going up because a lot of people, again, are speculating that they want to be investors in these new projects. And again, there's a whole game to be played for both of these projects, all of these projects. You need to learn and study and understand the risk versus rewards. Remember, I'm not telling you to buy, sell, or trade any of these coins. Just sharing with you updates of what is available on the market. And you get to learn first here. And that is the name of the game. Being somebody who is educated, they understand the risks, and they understand too that they are so early to all of this that all of these crypto coins right now are all under a dollar. So expect volatility for all these crypto projects, and I believe that there will be some hyperist things happening in the very, very near future. Thanks again for watching this video. Click those links down below. Thanks again, and I'll see you in the next one.